in this video, I'm going to show you one of the best ways to beat man-to-man -man defense out of the trips tied in. Now, if you uh, want to check out my trips tied in ebook, the link will be down in the description. You can join the Patreon for just $10. It's only 10 bucks to get access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. So again, if you're interested, make sure that you check out that link down in the description below. All right, guys, so I wanted to jump in here to some practice mode and walk you through a really, really effective way that I like to beat man coverage consistently out of the play or out of the formation trips tied in. And really what I like to do is utilize this play Pats YN. This has been one of the best man beaters all season long. But now that we have practice mode, I can kind of show you what makes this play so good, especially with the current abilities that you can rock in Madden Ultimate Team. So what I have here is I have short and elite on Cooper Cup. I have short and elite on Steve Smith. And I have short and elite on Darren Waller. So my setup for this play, and I have hot round master on Aaron Rodgers. What we're going to do is we are going to put our tight end on a corner route. We're going to block our running back so that we can pick up any pressure. We're going to slant our outside trips receiver. And then when we motion this outside trips receiver across the formation, we're going to put Cooper Cup on a C route. Now you have to wait for him to motion before you can put him on a C route. So again, I'm going to go to man coverage here. You're going to see I'm going to motion this guy. As soon as I do, he's going to come up on the line of scrimmage. I can now put him on a C route. I'm going to snap Jalen Waddle about right here. And this C route is going to absolutely cook man-to-man -man coverage over the top for a big, big play. Uh, pretty much destroys man coverage on that side of the field. Um, if your opponent is running, let's say your opponent is running like you know, some Mike Blitz zero or whatever, really any man-to-man -man meta, what you're going to notice is if they put this outside third here, um, you know, you're going to see here that that outside third is going to always travel with him unless he's actually in a cover three. And so you're able to hit this pretty consistently regardless of the man-to-man. -man. So if they're spamming man coverage, this is a really, really, really good setup uh, for attacking that. Now, another thing that this is good for um, is let's say that they start doing something like this where they're going to base a line maybe out of a dollar type of look or something and they're going to put this outside third right here. What you're going to notice is we're going to get kind of a man swap whenever we do this motion. So what you're going to see here is you're going to get kind of an interesting uh, setup here. But basically, we're going to set up our play and then we're going to motion uh, Cooper or uh, motion Waddle across and what you'll see if you watch Waddle and Waller now Darren Waller is going to be switched on against this linebacker now right there he wasn't able to beat him uh, but you can just high point everything in this game as you can see and it's going to be effective so you can utilize this this motion this also is going to like I said get you matchups where if they're going to want to try to base in line to try to stop the the C route which it will stop the C route by the way uh, if you look to the to the left uh, it will stop the C route. Now you've got the corner route right there, as you see right that time. Really does a good job of getting over the top. We need to maybe freeform that over the top, you know. But you can see there that you have a chance to be able to beat man to man that way as well. Um, and it's even going to be worse if, let's say, they did something like this. You know, now you know maybe they're crisscrossing their coverage or whatever, doing all kinds of things to try to make an adjustment here. And what can happen is when they start to base align stuff against trips tied in, if you can motion snap um, different players at different times, you're going to get really, really good matchups uh, where you can do stuff like that. Now, the other piece of this play against man coverage that I'd want to hit on is a lot of people, what they like to do to try to stop this play is they're basically going to um, essentially, you know, kind of drop some coverage out of this. Um, let me try to illustrate as best I can here, but basically you'll see here that this guy is going to be in man coverage on the triangle receiver. This guy will be in man coverage on the running back, and then they'll take this safety and drop him in his own on that side, right? So something like that. Uh, they may even put that guy in an actual outside third. So if that's the case, if we get if we get this setup right here, then I want you to look to the flat on the left. Your flat route is going to cook that coverage really, really well. And you can pass like that outside again against that coverage. So this play is really versatile against man, to co uh, man coverage. From a zone perspective, it's not actually that bad. Um, you have a really nice little high-low, so I'm just running some zone. Basically, if they're not playing hard flats, you want to throw this route to Smith uh, every single time. It is one of the best routes in the game this year uh, because of how the, the route runs, especially if you have short and a lead on your player. You want to be utilizing that route 
um, against the coverage. Now, the, the other thing I want to show you is if they do hard flat, um, then you want to try to wait on the slant and you want to throw that right in that little pocket right there. Pat's YN is a very equipped play to be able to attack the current defensive meta that we're seeing. We're seeing a lot of man-to-man. -man. Zone coverage is really bad this year, and we're seeing a lot more man coverage um, uh, continue in the meta. So you need to have some good man beaters. This play is one of them for you. Um, if you want to learn more about the trip side in, you can get everything in our Patreon. Our Patreon is only 10 bucks. It's going to get you access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive updates. Um, so if you want to sign up for that, head down to the description below and click the link down below.